Hi there boys and girls. This is Mr. Drolly for Green Devil Science and this is another episode of Science Talk. Um, right now I'm standing in one of two of my uh, micro orchards that I have on my acreage. Uh, micro orchards are typically um, orchards, fruit tree orchards that have uh, probably 10 or less trees in them. So you can see right over here I have uh, two trees, two apple trees. Uh, here I've got some elderberry bushes. Uh, over here I've got a plum tree. And over here uh, I've got another apple tree. So right here, this tree in front of us happens to be one of my favorite apple trees. It's a honey gold tree. Uh, typically it has apples that are um, close to softball size and uh, kind of yellow skinned and firm and very sweet. So uh, the goofy thing about apple trees is if I want another apple tree like this, um, I can't just take a seed out of one of the apples and plant it. You know, I won't get the exact same tree um, that's currently growing here. I won't get another honey gold tree. Uh, the reason being is because uh, the seeds are actually hybridized or crossed with this tree over here, uh, which is a Harl's Red, and also this tree over here, which is a Cortland. So um, if I did try and plant a seed out of this tree, uh, out of my honey gold tree, I'll just get um, kind, of, kind of a mixture of trees. I don't really know what properties I'll get. So if I want another honey gold tree, if I want another exact tree like this, I either have to buy one, uh, which a tree like this is not typically carried uh, in stores around here, so you'd have to special order it, probably for around 100 bucks. Uh, my other opportunity, my other chance to get an exact copy of this tree would be to graft a branch. And that's what I'd like to talk about today. 